Warriors, happy Tuesday. Today is Tuesday, October 27, 2020. Lunch choice for today is breaded chicken, served with baked beans, sliced carrots, apple slices, pizza, and milk. We do not have any birthdays today. Let's see, today is our second day of Red Ribbon Week, so crazy socks and hat day. Tomorrow is e-learning day, but then on Thursday, we are going to wear our school colors, which are, uh, are blue and orange. And we encourage you to either donate uh, pet food or pet treats or a pet toy or just a dollar so that we can help the Humane Society out by those do giving them donations. And then on Friday is our last day of Red Ribbon Week and you get to wear your Halloween costume. So boys and girls, you will still be required to wear your mask, this mask, on Friday. So think about that when you're planning out your Halloween costume. See, saying no to drugs, listen up. Saying no to illegal drugs isn't always easy, even when we know it's what we should say. It can take real courage. Someone wise once said that courage is the ability to do what is right, even when there is a lot of peer pressure to do what is wrong. But peer pressure isn't always a bad thing. Sometimes others pressure us to do what's right. That's called encouragement. When we encourage others, we give them courage. Everyone needs a wise encourager, someone to help him or her to say no. So today is our second day of Red Ribbon Week. Today, ask someone who encourages you what it takes to say no to drugs. What might, that might be a parent, teacher, counselor, or faith leader. Remember, it's not always easy to just say no. Will you be courageous enough to say no when the time comes? Hmm, with something to think about, this is Mrs. Vulcan. Make it a great day or not. The choice is yours. Boys and girls, please stand and face the flag for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence.